What's going on? It's Retro Football Revolution. Now, the following monologue, just as a warning, contains both strong language and an immense amount of acting talent. With that said, here's John Sitton's Bring Your Dinner monologue. Don't be coming back at me when I'm shouting at you above the crowd and above the next bench, alright? Because I run this fucking football club until I'm told otherwise by the fucking circus upstairs. And if you come back at me, you'll be following Terry down the road. You see me tomorrow, you're on a fortnight's notice. Because that performance was the straw that broke the camel's back. And it will not be tolerated in this dressing room while I'm in charge. The straw that broke the camel's back, that is typical fucking Leighton Orient. Sits, you're too intense, you're this, you're that, no one can talk to you. reason I was intense is because I wanted to win again. Don't you remember what I was saying to you about how good players want to be good players all the time? Don't you know how profound that is if you're not examining the fucking words? Because you've had two good performances and you think, oh, I'm Bertie Big Bollocks tonight, I'll play how I like. Well, you won't play how you like. Because if you play how you like, I'll stick the fucking youth team on. Because if I'm going to take abuse from a bunch of cockroaches behind me, I'll take abuse doing it my way. Which is fucking conformity, not fucking non-conformity. So you, you little cunt, when I tell you to do something, and you, you fucking big cunt, when I tell you to do something, do it. And if you come back at me, we'll have a right fucking sort out in here. And you can pair up if you like. And you can fucking pick someone else to help you and you can bring your fucking dinner. Because by the time I'm finished with you, you'll need it. You fucking hear what I'm saying or not? You see me in the morning. 